Anna's like a, a river flowing. And if you get in it, you flow with it. She's the rock of our family. So when she was diagnosed with glioblastoma in 2023, it really shook us to our core. You know, when they said it was terminal, I thought about the kids, how would it impact them? The time is um, precious, it's important. I mean, I wanna be here for it all. Each year, more than 12,000 people in the U.S. are diagnosed with glioblastoma, an incurable form of brain cancer. The average survival is less than two years. Glioblastoma is relentless. It grows aggressively, adapts quickly, and evades the immune system. It's not just a cancer genetics challenge. It's a mechanical engineering problem where gravity has been working against us. So we wondered, what if going out of our world might actually be the key to saving lives here on Earth? Three, two, one. In 2024, Notre Dame engineering professor Neenal Dada and her team launched a first-of-its-kind glioblastoma experiment to the International Space Station. There, they successfully leverage microgravity to accelerate the growth of more realistic tumor models. We've proven that space allows us to test therapies at a pace we simply can't match on Earth. Up there, the promise is infinite, and hopefully that leads us to a cure sooner. The selection process for the International Space Station is very rigorous. We look for groundbreaking ideas and for teams with a skill and drive to carry them forward. Professor Data's work is bold, innovative, and deeply patient-focused. To know that people are out here thinking outside the box, that gives me courage. The University of Notre Dame asks, what would you fight for? Fighting to cure brain cancer. We are the Fighting Irish. <laughs>